The Sweet 16 of the NCAA tournament may not have any Illinois teams left. That's true, but Matt Zahn joins us, and he says there's a bunch of Chicago area players we can follow, including one surprising participant. Yeah, that's right. The Princeton Tigers are the story of the Sweet 16, and a couple Chicago area guys are helping lead the way. Evanston Township's Blake Peters, only a sophomore, and Glen Barb West, Caden Pierce, a freshman, are playing key roles for the Tigers, and their high school coaches aren't surprised. Blake was a coach's dream. I mean, the minute he walked into our school from day one as a freshman, you know, he had a goal to play varsity, and not only did he play varsity, he started the first game of his career and started his entire career. So um, Blake's a special player, and we always felt like he was going to go on to great things. We just didn't know it would be so soon. We're just proud of where Caden's at, and from day one, we knew he was a winner. He won at the Under Armour Circuit National Championship. He won at the state championship level in Illinois. And now he's uh, in the Sweet 16 with potential to win a national championship. So it's fantastic, and the town of Glen Ellen is um, rooting him on. Their coaches may not be surprised, but of course it is unexpected that Princeton, a 15 seed, is in the Sweet 16, just the fourth 15th seed or lower to make it this far. The Tigers followed up their shocking win over Arizona with a dominating performance against Missouri. Not surprisingly, both of these coaches have liked what they've seen from the Princeton staff. I love the way they're playing. Coach Henderson does a great job. Um, it's great to watch them play with both passion and poise. And you can just tell that they've got, he's got a good pulse on their team and they're in a rhythm right now. We're just hoping Blake comes in and contributes the way he has been the last few games. Everybody as a coach loves to see guys sharing the basketball and uh, playing with joy. And that's the other thing I see out of these Princeton Tigers is the amount of joy and, uh, uh, that they have for each other and uh, you know the pride that they have walking on that court. Blake Peters scored 15 points in the Tigers win while Caden was dominant on the glass grabbing a new career high 16 rebounds. We always knew that Cade was um, elite rebounder um, offensively and defensively because he goes to pursue the ball and um, that was one of the characteristics that got us to the state championship is his unselfishness. And if you're worried about the moment being too big for the Princeton Tigers, perhaps Blake Peters can teach them about what it's like to be in the limelight. Seems like it's deja vu because his freshman year as a ninth grader, he hit a game winning shot off a missed free throw that ended up being an ESPY nomination. So not too many ninth graders in high school are sitting next to professional athletes and collegiate athletes in Los Angeles in the ESPYs. It just seems like the stage and the bright lights fit Blake. And now Blake, Caden, and the rest of the Tigers hope they can stay on the big stage for one more week. Yeah, if they win again, probably another SP coming. Princeton faces sixth seeded Creighton Friday night at eight in Louisville. As we mentioned, Peters and Pierce, just two of a number of Chicago area natives still playing in the Sweet 16.